And finally tonight, the Marine who fought for his country after 9-11 returned home and just blocks from the World Trade Center. He's reminding everyone what he was fighting for. ABC's Rebecca Jarvis with the man who is America strong. 7,000 miles from Fallujah, just steps from where the Twin Towers went down 12 years ago. Charlie Reeder is about as close to accomplishing his dream as you can get. To be able to be blocks away from the reason why I was in Iraq and Afghanistan is, uh, is really amazing. Reader is part of a special 10-week internship at the New York Stock Exchange for 28 returning military veterans. Three years ago, as a Marine and machine gunner in Iraq, Reader couldn't have even imagined it. Uh, we were going down the street and there was a, a cooler that was filled with explosives and ball bearings and DVs and just all types of debris. But now he faces a very different reality. These are some of the best people you will hire best people you will hire. Duncan Niederauer started the program two years ago when unemployment among young male vets returning from war was two times higher than the rest of Americans. Now the rate is half that at 10 percent. The veterans have all the character traits you and I or anybody else as an employer would want. They're, they're all the stuff we can't train, character, dealing with adversity, being a good teammate, check all the boxes. Today, Reader's been checking his own boxes, like ringing the closing bell. I honestly don't have words to, to describe uh, my, my life past since, since joining the Marine Corps, getting out of it, uh, just, having, just having any opportunity uh, whatsoever. Charlie Reader, teaching all of us what it means to be America strong. That's Rebecca Jarvis, ABC News, New York. Incredible experience and, education. and thank you for watching on um, this 9-11, 12 years after the first one. And we thank you for sharing your three words with us today, the words that matter to you.